日本語能力試験まであと2ヶ月勉強しなきゃ。みなさんこんにちは。Welcome back to 日本語。元気ですか ？I hope you're doing well. Before we begin, make sure to check out the vocabulary list for this lesson. This is part one of Minanoni Hongo Intermediate Lesson 7. In this lesson, we will learn about the following grammar points. はい、準備できたら始めましょう。Our first grammar point is 何々なくてはならない or いけない and 何々なくても構わない。何々なくてはならない or いけない is similar to 何々なければならない、which means that something must be done or is obligatory or necessary. So, meaning have to or must. So, this literally means that if you don't do something or this action, it won't go well. So, what's the difference between nani nani nakote wa naranai and nani nani nakote wa ikenai? So, naranai is used when you are. Generally speaking, of things that must or have to be done. For example, paying taxes. So we say, Minna wa zeikin o harawanakte wa naranai. On the other hand, nakote wa ikenai is usually、uh, for the speaker. The speaker thinks that he or she must do this. For example, studying. Testo ga aru kara benkyo shnakte wa ikenai. The other grammar point is nani nani nakote mo kamawanai. So this is similar to nani nani nakte mo i des, which means that something is not necessary needed to be done or no need to do something. Literally, it means if you don't do this, it won't matter or it won't be a problem or I won't mind it. So nani nani nakote mo kamawanai is more formal. Than nani nani nakote mo i des. So usually you don't use this with your friends or family. You just stick to nani nani mo i des. Kamawanai is more of、um, uh, when you're talking in a more formal situation. So first, let's review. In lesson 17, we've learned about nani nani nakereba narimasen, meaning must or have to do something. For example, kusuri o no ma nakereba narimasen. Or no ma nakereba naranai, meaning I or you must drink the medicine or this medicine. In the same lesson, we've also learned nani nani nakte mo i des, meaning not necessary or you don't have to. For example, nani mo mote konakote mo i des, you don't have to bring anything when you come. So how do we use nani nani nakote wa naranai and nani nani nakote mo kamawanai? For this grammar point. We need to use the verb in nai form, and then we remove i, so it becomes verb na plus kute wa nara nai, kute wa ike nai, kute wa nari masen if it's formal, or kute mo kama wa nai and kute mo kama i masen, which is the formal of kama wa nai. For example, the verb benkyo shimas to study. So we want to say I have to study, so we change it to nai form. Benkyo shinai, remove i. Benkyo shina, kute wa naranai, or benkyo shina kute wa ikenai. We can also say benkyo shina kute mo kamawanai, or benkyo shina kute mo kamai masen, meaning don't have to study or it's not necessary to study. For e adjectives. We also remove the e syllable, and then we replace it with ku, and then we add te wa nara nai, te wa ike nai, te wa nari masen, te mo kama wa nai or te mo kama i masen. For example, the e adjective short mijikai, so remove e, replace it with ku mijika ku, te wa nara nai, or mijika ku te wa ike nai, meaning. It must be short. We can say mijika kote mo kamawanai, meaning it doesn't matter if it's short. We can also say mijika kunaku from mijika kunai, not short. So we replace the e syllable here. 
短くなくても構わない。Even if it's not short, it's fine or it doesn't have to be short. For na adjectives and nouns, we add de before we add なくてはならない or なくてはいけないand so on. For example, the adjective anzen, safe. So, if we want to say it must be safe, we say anzen de なくてはならないor anzen de なくてはいけない On the other hand, we can say anzen de なくてもかまわない Meaning, it doesn't have to be safe For nouns such as isha, a doctor Again, we add de isha de なくてはならない or isha de なくてはいけない Must be a doctor Or, isha de なくてもかまわない Doesn't have to be a doctor For example, this medicine must be taken three times a day. この薬は一日三回 Our verb is to drink a medicine. So, 飲みます We use the nai form. 飲まない Remove i. 飲まな plus くてはならないこの薬は一日三回飲まなくてはならない Another example, there might be a test tomorrow. I have to study. 明日テストあるかも。Our verb is to study. 勉強します becomes 勉強しない。So, 勉強しな have to くてはならない。明日テストあるかも。勉強しなくてはならない。Or, しなくてはいけない。If you feel better, it's alright not to take this medicine. 調子が良くなったらこの薬を Again, the verb is to take the medicine or 飲みます飲まない飲まな So in this case, not necessary or you don't have to. So we use くても構わない調子が良くなったらこの薬を飲まなくても構わない Next example, would you please give a speech at the wedding? It doesn't matter if it's short. So here we are using an E adjective. So first, 結婚式でスピーチをしてもらえませんか Would you please give a speech at the wedding? Then, our adjective is 短い So again, remove E and then replace it with く短く plus でも構わない。It doesn't matter if it's short. 結婚式でスピーチをしてもらえませんか短くても構わないです。What kind of girlfriend do you like? どんな彼女がいいですか Or どんな彼女が好きですか、mm, She doesn't have to be pretty, but she has to be a doctor like me. So we have an adjective and a noun. えっと、彼女は Our first adjective is pretty, きれい which is a な adjective, so we add で。きれいでなくてもかまわない。She doesn't have to be pretty, けど、but 私と同じ。Like me, or same as me, 医者でなくてはいけない。Must be a doctor. えっと、彼女は綺麗でなくても構わないけど、私と同じ医者でなくてはいけない。Our next grammar point is 何々なくちゃ or 何々なきゃいけない。In informal conversation, 何々なくてはいけない can become 何々なくちゃいけない。And 何々なければなりません can become 何々なきゃいけない。If the verb is verb なくてはいけない we remove てはいけないand then we use ちゃいけない So verb なくちゃいけない Or we can also say いけません formal of いけないならない or なりません or だめ For example, again same verb to study、uh, I have to study So we say 勉強しなくてはいけない 
So if we want to shorten it or make it a more casual, we say, Benkyo shinak cha ikenai. Or simply, Benkyo shinak cha. Another example is to eat or have to eat. Tabenakute wa ikenai. It becomes, Tabenak cha ikenai. Or, Tabenak cha. For nakereba narimasen, we use kia. Verb nakereba narimasen, so we remove kereba narimasen, and then we add kia, ikenai, ikemasen, naranai, narimasen, or dame. For example, benkyo shi nakereba naranai, I have to study. So it becomes benkyo shi nakya ikenai, or simply benkyo shi nakya. Tabe nakereba naranai becomes tabe nakya ikenai. Or tabinakya. Nakucha and nakya can be used interchangeably, but nakya sounds more in a hurry. Also, we can remove ikenai um, if it's not followed by anything. That's why we can say benkyo shinakya or tabinakya or uh, benkyo shinakcha or tabinakcha. For example, I'm sorry, I can't go out to eat. I have to write a report by tomorrow. Gomen, shokoji ni ikenai. Ashita made ni repoto wo. Our verb is to write. So we use kakanakute wa ikenai. If you want to say it in informal way. So we remove te wa ikenai. Kakanaku plus cha ikenai nda. So nda here is just to give a reason. Gomen. Shokuji ni ikenai. Ashita made ni repoto wo kakanaku cha ikenai nda. Next example. I have to go home early today, so please submit the report by 5 o'clock. Kyo, hayaku. Our verb is to go home. So, have to go home. Kairanaku te wa ikenai. So, it becomes kairanaku plus cha ikenai kara. Because I have to go home early today, goji made ni repoto wo dashite kudasai. Kyo hayaku kaeranak cha ikenai kara. Goji made ni repoto wo dashite kudasai. Only two months left before the JLPT. I have to study. Nihongo noryoku shiken made ato ni kagetsu. Ganbatte. Have to study is Benkyo shi na kereba naranai. So remove kereba naranai. Benkyo shi na kia ikenai. Ganbate benkyo shi na kia ikenai. Or simply benkyo shi na kia. Because it's not followed by anything, we can remove ikenai. Nihongo noryoku shiken made ato ni kagetsu. Ganbate benkyo shi na kia. Next example. Ah, I'm late for work. I have to hurry. Ah, shigoto ni okure chao. Have to hurry. Isoga na kereba naranai. Isoga na kia ikenai. Or isoga na kia. Ah, shigoto ni okure chao. Isoga na kia. Our second grammar point is nani nani dake da or tada. Dake de i. So this is used to indicate a limit, meaning only or just. So we first learned about nani nani dake from beginner lesson 11. Do you remember? It's noun plus dake, meaning only noun. For example, kyodai ga hitori dake imasu. I only have one sibling. So this time, we can also use it with verbs and adjectives. So how do we use this pattern? Same as before, we just add it to a noun, uh, noun plus dake. In case of verbs, we change a verb into plain form, and then we add dake. And same with e adjectives, na adjectives. And then we can add da, which is the plain form of des. So da, des, or de, i, des. So dake, da. Dake des or dake de i des. For example, the noun nichiyobi, Sunday. Nichiyobi dake, only Sunday. Or the verb yondeiru is reading a book. Yondeiru dake, 
meaning is just reading a book. For example, there is only one foreign student in my school. 私の学校では外国人の学生は So we have a quantifier, one foreign student or one person. Hitori only dake imas. Watashi no gakko dewa gaikoko jin no gakse wa hitori dake imas. Next example is using a noun. I only have Sundays off. Yasumi wa, so my off is only on Sundays. Nichiyobi plus dake. Yasumi wa nichiyobi dake desu. Yasumi wa nichiyobi dake desu. Next example. What are you doing or what are you doing? I'm just reading a book. So here we have a verb. So if it's a verb, we change it to plain form. So first, what are you doing? Nani o shiteru no? Nani o shiteru no? I'm just reading a book. Tada, so here we use this tada nani nani dake. Tada, hon wo yonde iru. So again, in plain form, followed by dake. Tada, hon wo yonde iru dake desu. I'm just reading a book. How about this? I'm sorry, I'm just looking around. So it's a situation where a salesperson is talking to a customer. So here the salesperson is recommending something to the customer. And the customer says, oh, No, I'm just looking around. Sumimasen. Chotto mitteiru. So looking around or looking. Mitteiru dake desu kara or dake desu. Are you ill? I just feel a little sick. Byoki desu ka? So if it's、um, a more serious illness, we say byoki. Byoki desu ka? Chotto kibun ga warui. So here we have an adjective. Chotto kibun ga warui. Dake desu. So, meaning it's not a serious illness, but more of feeling just a little sick. Chotto kibun ga wari dake desu. Next example, how do I apply? Just write your name on this paper. Moshikomi wa do desu ka? Or, Moshikomi means application. Moshikomi wa do desu ka? Just write your name on this paper. Again, we have A sentence, so we change it to plain form. Kono kami ni namae o. So the verb is to write, so kaku. And then we add dake. Kono kami ni namae o kaku dake de i i des. Meaning it's alright if you just write your name on this paper. Kono kami ni namae o kaku dake de i i des. This coffee maker is easy to operate. All you have to do is press this button. Kono kohi maker no sosa ga kantan desu yo. So, sosa means operation. So, the operation of this coffee maker is easy. Tada,、um, just tada, kono botan o osu. So, press this button. So, our verb is to press osu. Dake de in desu. Tada, kono botan o osu dake de in desu. In this. So again, in this is giving a reason. And our third grammar point is nani nani kana. This is used when you want to ask a question that doesn't demand an answer, usually when you're talking to yourself. So this means, I wonder. So how do we use this pattern? We can use it with verbs, adjectives, and nouns. So for verbs, we need to use it with plain form and then we add. Kana, for example, to go, iku. Iku kana, I wonder if I will go. Or in the past form, itta. Itta kana, meaning I wonder if someone went. For e adjectives, for example, e, a good. 
I ka na? Is this fine? I wonder if it's okay. For na adjectives, we have genki. Genki ka na? I wonder if uh, someone is doing well. And lastly, for nouns, for example, cat. Neko. Neko ka na? I wonder if it's a cat. I wonder what's a good gift for dad's birthday. I wonder if this sweater is good. So here the speaker is talking to himself or herself. Otoosan no tanjoubi wa kono prezento wa. So what's a good gift? Nani ga i? Literally means what is good. Plus, kana, I wonder what is good. Otoosan no tanjoubi no prezento wa nani ga i kana? Kono seta de i. Good. Okay, so we have an adjective. I kana. Or we can also use no kana if there are other options. For example, you are choosing between more than one. Konoseta de i no kana or konoseta de i kana if it's the only option. Next example. I want to try them all. I wonder what I should have. I wonder if this cake is delicious. Zenbu. Tabete mitai. Nani ni shio. This is a very useful phrase when we are trying to decide what to order. When we can't decide what to order. Nani ni shio. Nani ni shio kana. So I wonder what I should have. Kono keiki wa. So we have an adjective. Delicious. Oishi. Plus, no kana. Since we are choosing more from more than one option we use no kana kono keki wa oishi no kana another example i wonder where i should go in golden week kono golden week wa doko e iko so where i should go kono golden week wa doko e iko kana kono golden week wa doko e iko kana I wonder if Constantine is doing well. So we have here um, an adjective. Constantine san wa genki. So with adjectives, we just add kana. Constantine san wa genki kana. We can also say Constantine san wa genki no kana. So the negative form nani nani nai kana. May be used to make a less direct request or invitation, so it expresses speaker's desire and wants it to happen. So it basically means, I wonder if I can do it. I wonder if someone can do it. I wonder if something is possible. So I really wish this to happen. For example, we're all going to see the cherry blossoms tomorrow, and I was wondering if you would come with us. So here the speaker is expressing his or her desire、um, for this to happen, for the teacher to come with them. So we say, "Ashita mina de sakura o mini ikun desu ga." I was wondering if you would come with us. Sensei mo isho ni so the teacher isho ni together with us, and then our verb is to come. So here since. The speaker is talking to the sensei or the teacher. He wants to be more respectful, so he uses the、uh, more respectful form of to go or to come, which is irashaimas. So we use the nai form of this, which is irashara nai. So irashara nai plus kana. So won't you come? So it basically means won't you come? Ashita mina de sakura o mini ikun desu ga. Sensei mo isho ni irashara nai ka na to omoyemashite. And last example, I have to get all these materials copied by one o'clock, and I was wondering if you could help me. Ichiji made ni kono shiri o zenbu kopi shinakute wa ikenai n desu ke do or ikenai n da ke do. I was wondering if you could help me. So help me is tetsudate kuremas to help me. So we change it to nai form. 
手伝ってくれないかな手伝ってくれないかな一時までにこの資料を全部コピーをしなくてはいけないんだけど、手伝ってくれないかな ?Let's try! 今日は何をしなければなりませんか ?Write your answers in the comment section below. はい、お疲れ様でした。今日のレースはどうでしたか役に立ったら、Like ボタンを押してくださいね。もしコメントとか、質問があれば、ぜひ下に書いてください。I hope you learned something today. Make sure to subscribe and click the notification bell so you don't miss part two of this lesson. If you want to support this channel even more, consider becoming my Patreon to my Patreon page where you can get the lesson PDF and other study materials. Okay, that's it for this lesson. I will see you in the next one. Mata ne! I would like to give a big shout out and thank you to our elite scholars, Cornelius, Constantine, Kelly, and Ronan. And to our study buddies and Nihongo students, Hontoni, Arigato gozaimasu.